we had we had a trip or something, and he just like he like took the mic and started singing in front of the whole entire group. Oh, and the, the high group. school group. Yeah, and the yeah. high school group. Like in front of everybody. So what's my cup with PJ? It was kind of like really uh, bad. There's some really bad ones. When this one kid had a dodgeball, and then he hit it at one of the lights, and then it almost broke. So that's probably the funniest moment that happened. All of us have these funny stories or interesting stories to each other. Mm -hmm. They're in, it's fun. I remember I was serving pancakes for Palm Sunday, and this lady asked for eight pancakes and 12 sausages all for herself. So what are some things that you think were your favorite parts of middle school? Okay, well, I don't think anything could beat Mexico. Mm -hmm. That was a blast. And I think the other thing that I really enjoyed this year was the Surf Sundays. So those are a couple of my fun memories. Uh, yeah. yeah, I think mine's Mexico for sure. Yeah. Oh yeah. They worked their tails off getting everything done and just seeing um, just how all of them worked super hard and were just like, nope, I can do more. Like, let's go do this or playing with the kids or taking, you know, it wasn't even taking breaks. It was still like, I gotta keep going, I gotta keep going. And just mm -hmm. seeing the drive that they had because they were able to work side by side with the family, I think was amazing. And then. Yeah, yeah. Like, you should go to camp. Meet people and like get like get friends, like get people. To I mean, that's the first time I met him is on camp, so. Yeah. yeah sure. Just friendship in general. I felt like that was really great. And we got to have more friends, we got to have more communication and like, you know, just more heartfelt moments in like small groups and stuff. So. Not to care what other people think, because I definitely know that I did a lot in sixth grade. And it definitely showed a lot. My advice for the incoming sixth graders is probably to just not be scared to just open up to your group because the leaders are really understanding and will give you a lot of advice that can help you. Yeah, and if you guys have a chance to go to camp, do it because it's so much fun. And when you have your friends, be with them. Don't be letting other people tell you who you are and how you are. Yeah. That's how I think. A secure group of friends is like the, a thing that I find very important. I'm excited just to get some more opportunities because, you know, as you get older, you can try different things. Mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, I don't want people like looking down on me down on anybody here, you know, because we have a lot, we have a lot to tell. Um, I'm excited to make some new friends in high school and to, like, continue to grow with God. My hopes for high school is to probably gain more friendships and to come, become more independent and to also make the high school soccer team. I just hope that I can keep my friends. So is there anything that you guys are nervous about for high school? You're nervous about the new teachers? Yeah, and you don't know how they're going to act or like respond to any of your responses. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of nervous about like being able to juggle like schoolwork with also like things I enjoy like this. Mm -hmm. Sports? Yeah, sports and theater. You need to open up to people and because sometimes you can't always solve your own problems and you really need to open up to people and God and stuff. I've learned that you should always just trust in God and know that he has a plan for you. Um, I learned that God is just always with me like through the good and bad. Like when hard things happen, he's just always there for me. Uh, I have to, like, with small groups, it's uh, it gives you like a chance to share your thoughts and feelings with uh, other people your age, which is like, which can make you be more open and feel more comfortable. Oh, I think that people think that I'm more, like you said, bold than I actually am, because I don't think I am like that. Because maybe I do do something that could be like really funny, but then I go back and think about it, and I think that was really embarrassing, or like I shouldn't have done that, or and I overthink some things, and I feel like it's not always like I appear confident.